Hello everybody, welcome back to some Roblox and today I want to check out a bunch of Trevor Henderson games that literally have one to ten players. I didn't want to check out, um, you know, Jolius, sorry, Santi Jumbo's game, but there's no new morphs or anything like that. Every day though, there is an update. I see one every single day. There is an update on, on uh, Santi Jumbo's game, but I can't really find anything that's brand new. Also, what is this? So we have the map lobby and badges i don't know if this is going to be clicked on but this is called trevor creatures world test okay all right let's check it out let's see if there's anything that is mothman oh my god that thing is so fast all right why is mothman that big is this supposed to be mothman or is that something else that looks like a dog is there anything over here am i gonna die yeah i'm gonna die oh here's my health i don't know why health bars have to be so large wait is this supposed to be an obby wait maybe it is hold on let's try this out Oh god, oh god, please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. I'm just a noob. I'm just a no I'm just kidding. I'm not a noob. Haha, ha. you're an idiot. You're a big stinky. I'm just kidding. I'm being mean. I'm being mean. I'm sorry, guys. I'm being mean. All right, here we go. Jump up here. Jump up there. Jump up here. This is actually really good. I like this. The fact that they have challenges, a challenging obby. Not bad. Not bad. I'm failing the jump. Why? I think this is... Oh, there we go. For some reason, I couldn't... I'm up here now. Woo! There's nothing up here, though. There should be a badge. All right. Is there going to be anything over here? I don't think so. I'm going to go to the lobby. Oh, wait. What? That's how you do it? I'm so confused. I don't know how to... Oh, there we go. That's how we do that. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. This was made or updated this year. It might have been made last year. Let me check really quick. Oh, my God. It was made last year, and it was updated this year. So we have mommy long legs. This looks like a whole custom uh, morph and it has animations. So look at this, you guys. Th there's a lot of games that go under the radar. Wait, how do I go fast? I feel like I'm moving slower than ever. That's one thing to get. I don't know why that's they, a lot of people that make games. They make all these mods and everything or sorry, all these characters. And then I feel like they just don't get movement like correct. I feel like move my movement should be a lot faster. I'm so slow. Like so, so slow. Let me, uh, let me just restart here. Remorph. There's a lot of characters in here. I'm just going to go down the list and then we'll be like every character that we could possibly be. Uh, I know like, when you first start the game, you have to touch this blue mark right here. Or why did I say, oh my God, uh, uh, am I colorblind? This white mark right here. And then, uh, yeah. All right, let's go to morphs. Oh my gosh. Wait, they have cartoon cat eater. Wait, yo, yo, this game is, is actually good. There's actually like morphs in here. But, but like I said before, wait, how do I go? How do I go to the first lobby to make me move fast? I don't get that. Okay, let's close that out. I don't know how to reopen that either. Is that M N? I'm going to press every button that I possibly can. Yeah, I don't know how to reopen that actually. Okay, so let's just go down the list here. It looks like there is a troll. He's got a red glowing face. There is a duck right there. What is this? I don't know any of these characters. That looks like some smiling man. Um, I don't know any of these characters. Oh, there's Behemoth, maybe? Maybe these are custom OC Trevor Henderson creatures. I think that's what that is. All right, and I, I did see Cartoon Cat over here. Oh, dude. There's like angry Cartoon Cat, and he has like 12 arms or something like that. It looks like that, right? No, he has eight arms and eight hands. All right, so there's angry cartoon cat. I don't know what that thing is right there. It looks like a meat dog. I'm gonna call it meat dog. And then we have like some, I don't even know what that is. There's some alligator Trevor Henderson creature. Then we have big giant cartoon cat. That's pretty cool. I don't know what this thing is right here. It looks like a plant, like a stick bug. Is this supposed to be cartoon dog? I have no idea. Uh, this is supposed to be maybe Among Us? Among Us, Among Us sauce and pasta. There is traffic light head. I don't know who that is. Uh, I don't know who that is. This looks like a Enderman morph. This, this is looking cool. It looks like a Trevor Henderson siren head dog thing. I don't know. There is uh, this looks like a power line head. Then here is, this looks like it's called bus eater. I'm pretty sure this is called bus eater. That's cool. And I don't know any of these guys' names. Then we have mommy long legs from poppy playtime. And a bunch of other Trevor Henderson or super popular indie horror game characters. All right, so let's go ahead and become Bus Eater because he looks so dope. And 
Yo, I'm actually really fast. Okay, it was only mommy long legs that was slow. I'm actually pretty fast. This is good. It's all good. Okay, okay, okay. What's over here? Is this where all the, uh, 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 oh, what is this? What are these? Yo, there's like some custom characters in this game and it's actually really cool. I'm guessing we teleport with that. There we go. I am now bus eater. Let's try to get some morphs if we can. All right. I like this world. I guess it's pretty cool. Um, I feel like it's really hard to create a good sequenced world with the Trevor Henderson creatures. I think something like going about it with like, do you know how like the next bots chase you and like uh, Nico's next bots and uh, evade? I think if someone did that with like the, the um, Trevor Henderson creatures and did like an actual game mode or something like Dead by Daylight, it would it would do really well, like really, really, really well. I know that for a fact, but I don't know. You have to always add like new characters that are popular from indie horror games, and that's probably hard. I don't know how you would go about it, but there's a lot of games that do, in fact, do that. It's pretty cool. I can't find anything, so I'm going to go ahead and reset. All right. This is pretty cool, though. I don't know. Let me know in the comments below if you guys think this is dope. There's new Trevor Henderson games. Well, there's always Trevor Henderson games out there, but not a lot of people are playing them. Not a lot at all. All right, let's close that because we don't need it. I'm going to go ahead and become a cartoon cat. I'm going to become traffic light head. And then I'm going to become a super angry cartoon cat. And we'll try to find anything that we possibly can think of. There is Poppy Playtime over there. Maybe I'll become Poppy Playtime. I feel like Poppy Playtime really fell, well, fell down, fell off a little bit. Until we get a, like a new chapter, it's going to be, it's going to be, it's going to be kind of quiet. Dude, I'm, look, look at, look how giant I am. I'm just so slow. I'm so slow. And the fact that everything is so far away, I'm just like, okay, now I'm teleporting. Nice. Very epic. Like, how am I going to go across the world moving this slow? I can't run. It's too slow. Although this is cool. I do like it. This is a cool looking siren head. I, why did I say cartoon cat? Sorry. Me dumb. Me big dumb. Okay, let's um go ahead and... All right, let's go to morphs. Lobby? Sorry, lobby. Also, I don't like teleporting right here. I wish there was a... a what are those called? The escalators right there? That'd be pretty cool. Um, I wonder who's faster. I'm going to become angry cartoon cat and then we'll go from there and then I'm going to go ahead and jump games. We'll try out some other games, but this, this one actually had, a, it did have a player. Like as soon as I joined the game, someone actually joined this game and was playing it. All right, let's go ahead and go over here and boom. All right. Oh my God. I'm way faster. Am I even a cartoon cat? Actually? I don't know who I am. I'm way, way faster. Okay. So they got that right. This is pretty cool. This is cartoon cat with eight arms. <laughs> this looks cool. All right. Um, yeah. I don't know where the morphs are going to be. Honestly, this map is pretty large and I'm not trying to run around. I think that's what makes it really boring. Uh, having to run around, uh, and not find anything. I find that pretty boring. I think giving giving the player something to do is uh, is really fun. So, but there's not much. You just have to walk around and it's just like, oh, look at me, Blair. I don't know where to go. All right, I'm going to reset. All right, let's, uh, who should we be? Who should we be? I want to be bus head again or bus eater. Why don't I call him bus head? <laughs> this one actually looks really good. I like this. this is actually really, really cool. Dude, everything is so glowy in this game. Boom. All right, that's pretty cool. All right, I'm gonna go back. Okay, that was really weird. Um, now I'm in another Trevor Henderson RP game. What is this? This is actually kind of cool. Like, is Siren Head actually an ancient monster? It kind of doesn't even make any sense because like, they didn't have sirens in caveman times. So, <laughs> that's so funny. It's like, Sirens didn't exist like that, right? Maybe it did. Maybe it was like a canonical, sorry, conical, conical shape, and someone like, doo -doo 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 -doo, and then and then it became a monster or something. All right, in this game, you can become creatures and monsters of Trevor. They can catch you if you're human. You can play with your friends. Warning: This game has codes for skins. This code, wait, the codes will be hidden in the map. All right, that's pretty cool. Uh, let's become. Sorry, this creature has no... Wait, I hear I hear scary sounds. Wait, this game actually is kind of good. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and become Cartoon Cat. Wait, do I have to... 
Oh, here we go. There we go. I am now a cartoon character. I think this is a... It might be... It might be a free model with free animations. Can I remorph? Oh, I can. Wait, that's actually kind of cool. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Wait, I'm going to be cartoon dog. Someone wants me to record a uh, Roblox studio. Wait, can I not? Actually, I can't actually. Someone wants me to record um, Roblox studio. Oh, God, wait, can I not die? Run, walk, run, walk. It's not going to work. Oh, there we go. Nice. All right, can I run? No, I can't. I can't. Okay, it's fine. Headlight badge. So they got badges. What's up here? They got a portrait of Cartoon Cat and he's angry. Siren head right there. Is that like by a... Yeah, it does look like by a cemetery. All right, we're going to go ahead and jump down in the map. Okay, there's a weapon there. Wait, they have the back rooms like bacteria. Sword event badge. They had an event. Okay, that's cool. Yo, look at the... There's a player there and his name's Dummy. Yo, this... I'm surprised this isn't lagging. Look how dense the forest is i think this is like a free house can i enter oh god i can't because i'm colliding with everything all right that's fine um this is cool i'm really really slow though so i think can i reset i can't teleport to lobby how do i become a human again i don't think that i can can i become milk walker ambassador no i can't all right so in fact i think not even morphing at all and just staying as a human dude this guy looks like a giga chad <laughs> Staying as a human is actually better because I can run way, way faster. And I do want to see the monsters over here. And there are badges, so you got to check everywhere. I do like this house feature. Dude, what if someone made a monster game where you have to exfil and find uh, loot and you could do damage and uh, other stuff like that, earn points, earn economy, earn XP. That would be pretty dope. Honestly, it would. It would be super cool. What if what if I do videos on uh, Trevor Henderson games and then I end up um, publishing the game? That would be pretty cool. Oh, this is the sword code 7864. And I don't know if the codes are everlasting and changing. They could be. What is this right here? Is this a badge? No, I don't know what that is right there. I don't even want to become a badge because they're not even fast at all. Okay, um, I wasn't really able to run. What's over here? Are there even monsters like alive? This is a xenomorph. Are you alive? Oh, I can't run over there. Dude, I could see the monsters over there, but they're not. I can't go over there. There's like an invisible wall. That's unfortunate. All right, I'm just going to teleport to the lobby. That's actually cool that they have that. This is big right here. Having the teleport to the lobby is absolutely giant. Um, I don't think there are. Oh my God. Look how far I could zoom out. Can I see like the, the characters if I zoom out far enough and try to like, hold on. I could see where they're at kind of. Oh, I see them. They're, they're like right here. <laughs> oh my God. Okay. That's going to go ahead and do it. Let me know in the comments below if you guys want to see me spotlight uh, more Trevor Henderson games like this. And uh, yeah, hopefully they get more traction or people get motivated to update it more because like I said, there's a lot of games out there and a, not a lot of people are playing them. And there's actually not a lot of Trevor Henderson games out there with like any game mode properties other than like shooting at a monster over and over and over again. Anyways, that's going to go and do it. I'll see you guys in the next video. Until then, and always have a great time. Okay, bye bye.